rate of acceleration of technology is itself accelerating. And it's critically important to constantly be questioning, how can I be disrupted? Because remember, the day before something is truly a breakthrough, it's a crazy idea. So who inside your organization has a crazy idea? Ubiquitous access to technology will be what drives growth and scalability. The fact of the matter is, this journey isn't a technology conversation. It's maybe 10% technology. It's 90 or plus better percent business and leadership. Between now and 2030, AI will help drive 15.7 trillion of additional economic value. And that is for the businesses that leverage it. The business wave of AI, the wave that we are in right now, has the potential to arguably be the most impactful technology in all of our organization's histories. The technologies we're talking about today are meant to work and to make your brand promise come alive. We have to harness that technology to understand our customers better, define the experiences we want to deliver, and then align the organization to be able to do it. When you do it right, it's magic. Everybody has a blockchain managed service you can instantiate in three minutes or less. It's not about the technology, it's what you want to do with it. Just like AI, just like everything else that's happening. This is not about a technology transformation. This is about a labor transformation. It's about your workforce. I call this taking the robot out of the human. Artificial intelligence is essentially about helping to make better decisions, better decision making. AI will replace a number of jobs, but the goal of AI fundamentally is not to push humans out of the picture, it's to get humans working on the cool, important stuff. But we've also discovered something really inspiring, which is that the technology that we're developing now has the potential to help not just our companies, but to help life itself flourish like never before. If the business community is not adopting and scaling AI fast enough, we won't remain competitive. AI is only as good as how we build it and the data we give it. So how do we encode the ethics and the values into that technology so that we can trust it? We've got to move beyond fixing these legacy issues and focus on driving our people to rewire business operations to really stay ahead of the market. AI is definitely worth the effort because the results can really tremendously automate what you do or give you insights that can be great competitive advantage. But it is hard. And I advise my clients to look at it as a journey. It's be bold. Go ahead and, and get started. Be big in your thinking. Uh, try to build something today. Don't wait. Experiment, fail, try again. It's critical for you to be thinking about how AI and robotics and 3D printing and synthetic biology and AR and VR and blockchain will transform your industry because every single industry here is going to be dramatically transformed this next decade. And the only question you want to ask and be able to answer is, will you be a disruption victor or a victim? Are you going to stand there, comfortable in the place where you are today, and let it happen? Or are you going to actively do something today to make sure that you have longevity, that you will be here tomorrow?